This is Princey Seats Channel, your preferred channel for most current and detailed content and information needed. You are welcome. If you are new kindly subscribe and press the notification button for further update. An important message for Apostle Ken Wakama worthy of listening. To talk on some fat this morning, and that is the only thing that can make peace to reign as from next week. This week is gone, and we are looking at another week, which I tag the first week of February, and which it should be the week of disbursement. If AGPN, if Dr. Ken Nwankama of uh, UAAG, we allow the peace to reign. For peace to reign next week, AGPN and UAAG must create atmosphere for the peace to reign. It is not with the masses. It is not with the agitators. It is not we that are asking for our right that we we should we should be we should be we should we should be looking for peace now, because for the past one month, throughout the month of January, Grand Community has been so peaceful than ever before. But I think that is the period where when disbursement will have come up but they decided to uh, disagree with it. And now, others are preaching for peace, there will be peace. If only they decided to use this coming week to do the needful. Let me quickly mention those points I want to raise, because I have received a lot of calls, messages on my DM, and I want to bring those things into Nigerians, because I don't have answer to those questions so that let us call on those who has answer to them to come and answer us. Number one, after the meeting that was held with all Grand Pressure Group executive and UAAG executive, the outcome of the meeting was not acceptable by the masses. Yesterday, Abdu, the president of all grand pressure group came up to tell nigerians that what we are expecting has not landed that nothing of such yet that if anything of such happens he will do the needful within 30 minutes <laughs> abdu you are lying to nigerians this is what Nigerians are angry for. Secretism. People, you have all of you have turned this grant of a thing to become a courtis, a courtism uh, group where you keep secret. After the meeting of yesterday, Nigeria demand a good approach, a good a word of encouragement from you both party, but. Uh, uh, Jama Machine, the president of all Grand Petro Group, Abdul, came up and said the money has not landed, that as soon as the money gets to the appropriate account, who are you deceiving, sir? Because your uh, the chat room of all Grand Petro Group, Osadaud measured it, and I quoted him, that when they asked, by, when they asked Apostle Ken to bring account number, account, where the money will be Drop to he, he brought a sanctuary account that was what that was Ken and his daughter was a signatory to the account, but he said anyway, the money has been divided into three accounts. Go and list it to Osadaud chat on. So from Osadaud, we are got to know that the money has dropped, even when we know that the money has dropped. But officially, Usadaud hands it. That is number one. Number two, Barista Organ, who has to be the lawyer to UAAG, came up yesterday and gave a VN 
and in his brokers, he made mention of it that the money is in the theory account, which you, you particularly, Abdul, you are a signatory to the account that you refuse to sign. That is what is delaying disbursement. Then after all of you have discussed yesterday, I don't know whether you are sent to come and say it because I'll be calling you. You refuse to pick my call. I will send a message to you. You receive it or WhatsApp. You listen to it. You never respond. So I don't know whether you are sent to come and tell Nigeria that this money has never dropped. That would, uh, Abdul, you are lying to Nigerians. You are lying. If you tell Nigerians this, uh, somebody, if you are thinking that it's because of security purpose, we, do we have security in Nigeria? Or we, do we have any security in Nigeria? So please, this is a lie from you. So we are not taking that. That money must be disbursed next week. Please, if we really want peace to reign, let this money be disbursed next week. We have listened to lies and we can no longer listen to lies anymore. This is how it I started in the days of Sam. This is how it started in the days of Sam. Sam has the money. At the point of disbursement, some elements stood up and said, no, we must, we must, we must, we must, we must be involved, we must do this, we must do that. Out of annoyance, Sam took his money and went back to the state. Up to today, the case is still in the court. We are look, people are looking for a way of settling it so that this man can come back and do the needful. We, if we does not remember the days of sin, we can remember the days of Tepicon. This is how it started, though. They were pushing it up, down, up, down, up, down. There is money. Hello, Mama. There is money. CBN. Hello, uh, Ken. Uh, money there. Money there. Uh, this thing. Before we know. Many of us, we, we, we did not even know the beginning of uh, Tepecon. And to today, nobody knows how it ends. This is how it started. But this very one, we will not agree. Nigeria will not take it from you people. This money must be disbursed. Please, elders that are preaching peace in grand community, we, we are not the one to be, to be, to be preaching to to hold on, to hold peace. Talk to them. Talk to them. Call on them, Bishop Angbara. Call, I have called you and I've told you, I've talked to you, sir. Call on them. Call on Apost uh, Dr. Ken Wankama to come out to do the needful. So, Abdul, that your VN, you, you came to talk here, to tell us yesterday, is fallacy from the pit of hell. Nigerians, we are not taking that uh brokers from you for you to come and tell us that even the money has not dropped is a fallacy it is a lie from the pit of hell so whatever sharing formula you people are fighting for nigeria is not interested nigeria is not interested whatever percent any one of you wants to take take it yes all grand pressure group fought for this we appreciate you because when they were running after your life Tiubat is running after your life everywhere to, to, to assassinate all of you that you cannot sleep and close your two eyes. Nobody is there with you in Abuja. We appreciate you. But whatever percentage you take and let the remaining one to be disbursed. And let me correct one thing here, what I understand and what I know. If they are talking about percent, it is not the whole money that they are talking, they, are, they want to take percent from. They were fighting on the logistic because we, if our own findings have led us to know that grant will not come without logistic. There is a logistic money that was attached to this money. It is the money they all of them are fighting for. It is not the, this, the real money. So let's clear that now, Nigerians. It is the logistic money that followed this money. I was told that they were having issue with. So let's close our mind against their sharing formula. That is their own. That's take me to number two. Number two message is to Ken Nwankama, Dr. Ken Nwankama. Please, uh, Dr. Ken Nwankama, 
there is no more rumors that you and your team want to shortlist the NGOs and cooperatives who came for verification. It is no more a rumors that there, there are, you, you have already shortlisted those who came for verification. So Nigeria demands you to come out now and talk to us between now and Sunday. Dr. Ken Wankama, Nigeria deserves to hear your voice. Come and talk to Nigerians. Because when you want to collect 10,000 naira, you came to, anytime you want to collect money from us, you came to talk to us. Anytime you needed anything from us, Dr. Ken Wankama, you came up to talk to us. So it is time for us to do the needful now. You can no longer come to talk to us. So we are begging you, if they want peace to reign next week, uh, Dr. Ken Wankama, come out and talk to Nigerians. Come and give us the assurance that every NGO and cooperative that come for verification ha who has been captured in the verification will be disbursed to come out and tell us this we want to hear from your from you directly not from any spokesperson we want to hear this from you directly that every NGO and cooperative that 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 that, that participate in verification will be disbursed to by me Ken Wankama or between Monday or Tuesday, let there be paper, paper uh, publish, publication of all the NGOs and cooperatives that you will be disbursed to. It happened in the days of Tepicon when all the reg all the qualified uh, NGOs were publicized. Heaven did not come down. So we are advising you now. You can do paper publication of all the NGOs and cooperatives whom you will be disbursed to. I don't think anything is hidden in that. Well, if you have a better opinion not to do that, but you can come out and prom and say to us verbally that you promise that all of us, all the NGO that verified will be disbursed to. That will calm the nerves of people that are calling from left and right to confirm whether the NGO is come captured or not that is for that finally finally we are calling for disbursement failingly monday on tuesday because there is no reason of delaying this money in end to end for another one week again there is no reason there is no reason there is no reason because Barrister Organ has told Nigerians that it is all grand pressure group who refuses to sign check, who refuses to sign. That is